Hi guys, not that long ago I made a poll in my group about uh, how do people understand my definition of uh, mud flood and you know the majority voted uh, quite opposite that I was promoting all these two or even two and a half years so uh, my definition of mud flood was uh, you know used just like a brand for the occasion it took place in uh, highly likely in 19th century in 1840s 1850s or somewhere close to these dates and uh, it consisted on 90 percent of clay and sand so it's like uh, silicon based quartz based particles and maybe 10 percent of it is uh, dust uh, dirt and mud whatever you call it it's all the same it's black black colored mud and something like gray stuff and all this stuff so you've seen dust in your life you know so I like uh, created this mud flood be because it sounds uh, very, you know, very cool, uh, very understandable. Mud flood sounds good, right? It's better than uh, talking about some buried stuff because uh, you know buried is uh, not quite the topic, right? And it's better than clay mud, clay flood or whatever. So it's like you know just a brand name for all this occasion that is uh, concerning this 19th century catastrophic events worldwide because it was uh, also related to fires it also related to destruction of houses of the walls and all this stuff and rebuilding it and uh, you know clearing away the evidence cleaning up after the floods you know Bur burying uh, and burning the evidence in fact burying and burning is like it sounds pretty much the same as you can see so it's all just uh, pulling the facts towards this theory because in every major city in its uh, centers of downtowns whatever you call them you can find plenty of uh, places where excavation were performed and they found a bunch of uh, red brick buildings underneath the ground with the windows and doors arches and all this stuff so it's like a worldwide event and you can go in whatever city or um, country and you'll find this evidence worldwide so it's it's just a brand name for this occasion so don't get pissed off because I call it just a mud flood maybe it doesn't you know perform uh, the best way of expl explaining what it's really the, the case right but it's pretty cool definition and it sounds good and it's uh, it's hyping right now on trends check out the Google Trends and you'll see that the mud flood is on very high level of potential right now uh, more than before so a bunch of people opening groups and I'm really glad that this year is ending with so many uh, views on this topic because uh, views are like growing exponentially and uh, people are getting more subs those those who started the channels this year they already have like 10 plus thousand subs and this is really great because people starting big bloggers starting to share information share their opinions on the topic and you know uh, right now we are uh, hyping on the topic and we're supposed to expand and uh, find new frontiers of it get more footage from the people uh, include it in some folders or open storage databases and find some more diamonds like this and uh, make 
new videos and explain it explain our opinion on this topic so thanks a lot guys for watching and see you later the new chats are coming up soon next week so stick around see ya